A few years ago in 2019, I did a speed run on an eighth. I smoked an eighth of weed as fast as I could, and I got one of the highest I've ever got while filming a video, and probably one of the highest times I've ever been. Like, I, I literally, like, after I filmed the video, I just went out in the living room and sat on the couch for probably, like, three hours straight. I don't even remember, like, if I was watching TV or what I was watching. I just remember doing it, and then, like, hours later, I was like... <sighs> I, uh, I better, I better start doing, doing some stuff. Now, real quick, YouTube just demonetized me. I'm super miffed about it. But if you want to support me and you have Amazon Prime, you can subscribe to my Twitch for free. You don't have to spend any money and you can support me with Amazon Prime. Or if you do want to spend money, you can't do it here anymore. Go subscribe to my Twitch or my Kick channel. I think we're going to do some after hour streams on Kick and maybe multi stream to some other sites. So I'm so glad I have this video still saved on my computer. It's one of the videos that I deleted from my channel. I deleted a lot of the videos that were age restricted in an attempt to get monetized last year. And I did get monetized. It, it lasted for nine months. And then they took it away. They're like, you know what? We actually, we don't like you, bro. We don't. No more money. So I'm glad I have the video. There's some videos that might have got lost in the transaction. But I still do have some of my good videos. I'm going to end up posting them. I'm a little sketched on saying the site where I'm going to post them. But it's that site that rhymes with the word uh, tumble. And it starts with the letter R. But if you go to cupins.com, it'll take you right there. So if you want to see this video, it's going to go live. Cupins.com. Check it out. So really quick, let me just lay out how this went. Because it was kind of a disaster. Like... I was watching the video earlier and I was like, bro, what were you thinking? Like, I really wasn't thinking when I put this together. So I used one single bong. I used one single ball. Terrible idea. And I didn't grind the weed up first. Literally the first minute or so of the video is just me like grinding the weed, getting ready. Now, I also had an idea to use this brand new screen for the bowl I'd never used before. I was like, wow, this will be good. And like after the first hit or two, I'm like, oh, I think it's clogged. Like it, it was literally a disaster. I didn't have the weed ground up. I was using a weird screen I'd never used before that did not work for my situation. And the single bowl was such a bad idea. I didn't even use a bowl with a little handle on it. I used this handleless bowl. That's good when you're taking like one or two hits. But when you take several hits, the bowl gets so hot and there's like no cool place to grab. Like I used one ball one grinder i had the pile of the nugs and bro i used reddit weed let me tell you about this i used reddit weed okay this was when i was in colorado springs there's a lot of medical dispensaries i went to the place the redditors talked about and i got like the best of the best weed because i knew i wanted to post this video on reddit like ooh, look i'm doing a speed run let me post it on reddit so i literally i got the redditor weed to do it so i showed it off in the video it was nice that's one of the factors like it's going to be different anybody who tries to do this challenge or whatever you're going to have a different experience but like the flower is the factor. Some of it could just be harsh. Some of it could just burn quicker. If I did the challenge again in the future, I would just pre-grind up the three and a half grams. I spent like two minutes or so in the video grinding. I don't know if I said the time yet, but I did the speed run in just under nine minutes. I smoked an eighth in less than nine minutes. And that's including grind time. That's including me like breaking up the nugs, using a screen and deciding I don't wanna use the screen anymore. It wasn't a perfect challenge. I did have some issues like hitting some of the bowls with the screen until I took it out. I didn't have air conditioning in my house in Colorado. So some of my sessions I would get really hot. Like I think I'm gonna post a one gram dab that I did. But I remember like turning my fan off and shutting the door because I didn't want the fan to blow all the vapor away and kind of ruin like the ambiance of the hits. But I remember doing that one and I just like swept my balls off. So I did a few smoking challenges where I was just like, oh my God, I'm getting so hot. But that literally is, I think back on it, is one of the times I just got so high while filming a video. And I think the reason that I got high is because I consumed like a regular amount. I can go through an eighth in like five hours, but when you do it in 10 minutes, it's like, bro but it is interesting to look back on an old video of me just about four years ago seeing how i smoke seeing how i get high i still have the piece but i don't really use it anymore i did say in the video like i want to do the challenge again and i've never done it again i i literally have never done it again i think that video got restricted it didn't do as well as i wanted i did end up posting it on a subreddit uh, wait, this is really funny because I just remembered. I posted it, I think, on the speedrunning subreddit. Like, speedrunning is normally for games. You try to beat 
your favorite game as fast as you can or whatever. But I posted it on there as a meme. I was like, let's see if it does well. And bro, there were like literal like critics on there. Somebody was like, oh, at the timestamp six minutes and blah, blah, blah. You can see him pull something off the screen. And it's like me pulling a stem off the nug and just like putting it in the ashtray or something like that. I can't remember what I was doing, but somebody was like timestamp the spot where like, check this guy out. I think he's cheating. I thought it was funny. It's not like a super serious challenge. I didn't take it that serious. It's going to be different between anybody who tries to do it. There's different pieces. There's different flour like we talked about earlier. There's no like perfect way to do it. It's not like an eating contest where it's like, oh, whoever ate the most amount of hot dogs because those are like gone when you're done. But when you're hitting something, when you're inhaling something, you can have a different approach as, as somebody else right next to you. And you might not get like the same experience or the same results. Like I bet if you had two people speed run on an eighth, but like you tested their blood for how many cannabinoids were in there, somebody might have more off of the same flour even just because they inhaled it a little bit differently. It doesn't seem like a perfect challenge, but it definitely was something fun to do. After that video was made, I think I inspired a few other people because I'd never seen a challenge like that. I had looked up speed runs for eights. I couldn't find anything on YouTube. Maybe there was one and it got deleted. It's not that crazy unique of an idea, but some other YouTubers did make videos like that. I had some people mention some to me and I just got to say like, I still got the record, bro. Nobody beat me. Mine was in under nine minutes, including grind time. Give me the gold. I don't know. I don't know what we need to do here, but I might be the world champion still i think i want to do this challenge again i don't really do a lot of smoking anymore i do mostly vaping but like i think i want to bring it back with with smoking you can't quite do the challenge the same with a vape but i don't know leave me a comment is that something i should try should i do the speed run again should we save it for like a special stream i'm doing a 12 hour sesh on 710 but maybe i'll do a speed run on 720 i don't know that could be fun. I think on 820, we're going to do like an all edible stream. I'm going to be able to say like a 820 edibles or something crazy. So don't miss out on those. We got a few events coming up. I might do the speed run on the eighth again. We'll see if anybody's interested. Also, I got to like build up some strength. I got to warm up the lungs and the throat. There hasn't been smoking here since 520. Either way, YouTube's a bunch of jerks. I'm making videos for free now. If you want to support me, tune into the Twitch stream. If you have Amazon Prime, you can give me that Jeff Bezos money without spending it. If you want to see the speed run on the eighth, Go to coupons.com. It should redirect you to that one site. I'm not sure if I can say. And if you're like, nah, I don't want to watch that. I want to watch your best ways to get high tier list and stay here on the tubes. Well, check out this video right here. Have a lit day, my dudes.